Well, uh, screwed up. It looks like I'm not going to be installing this today. I didn't realize that this is a 3 bar fuel pressure regulator. And this is a 2.5 bar, but it looks like the old one might be going back on. This is why you do your research before you spend money. Or why I should do my research before I spend money. I also bought this. This is the Idle Air Controller, AIC, commonly referred to. And I actually came across a very interesting post on a SOB forum that someone actually had a vacuum leak due to one of these. That these can fail over time and leak internally. The guy on the forum says he says he put his mouth on here, plugged this side, and inhaled, creating a vacuum on there, and he could pass air through it while it was blocked off. I did the same test on my old one, which I'm not going to show because it's embarrassing, and I had the same problem. I got this one in the mail yesterday, and I did the same test to this one, blocked this port off, sucked all the air out of there, and it was actually holding pressure. So hopefully this will fix the problem. This was actually cheaper than I thought it would be. I think it was around $22 shipped off of eBay. But this is not a OEM sob part. So we'll see just how well it does. fuel pump check valve. Hopefully this will hold pressure when the pump is off. Not sure if anyone can read this but this is the pressure side of the fuel pump and this one is the return line according to what I've read online this should have a check valve in it where the fuel can only go this way and should not be able to come back this one should be open and the fuel should be allowed to flow through Oh, I'm scared to do this because if I mess this up, there's not really a nice way to fix it. And this is probably the sharpest tool I have for cutting this plastic fuel line. Well, wish me luck. Yeah. 
am over tightening the crap out of these because I'm scared about it leaking. Okay, I'm gonna try to prime the fuel pump and see if we get any leaks. It's not leaking anywhere at the fuel pressure regulator where I messed with it and this line I just put on the fuel pump. No leaks, but it doesn't look like the check valve is really doing anything. And maybe I'll figure something out and I'll come back to this another day.